I need here. No, wait. It doesn't matter if you're in paradise. You could be next to a majestic waterfall surrounded by the beauty that is Hawaii, and yet you're still bound to run into an asshole. Case in point. You have the time. I'll do it. Meet Entitled Broski. Entitled Broski doesn't pay attention to things like rules, courtesy of other people, or fences that literally mean don't step over here unless you want to die. The only thing worse than dumb tourists are babies on planes, but we won't get into that right now. Hey, no, grab your hand, hand, hand. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, hold tight. I'm going. Hold tight. Can we hold him too? Can you hold him too? Oh, here, here, give it here. Here. I need here. No, wait. As you can see, Entitled Broski is, well, entitled. Who does he think he is? The Count of Monte Dumbro? By all means, save him, but do it the way that he wants. Don't mind the fact that Entitled Broski is slipping away faster than Joe Biden's approval rating. Can't wait to see how it ends. Wait. Come on, somebody, please. Let's watch that again, shall we? Wait. Come on, somebody, please. I almost feel like the Good Samaritan had about enough in that moment. He was like, nah, bruh, can you blame him? Don't get it twisted, he's risking his life too. Imagine hanging from a fence to save some D-bag who would more than likely treat you like shit if it was any other situation. Well, let's finish off the video and see if we can get a happy ending. And after all that, he doesn't even have the decency to say thank you. If someone just saved your life, wouldn't it be the first thing you'd say? This is the world now. People have become so entitled that other people, let alone stupid things like feelings, don't even register. Make no mistake, according to them, it's their world and we're just secondary characters. We've been overrun by clout-chasing zombies who feed off clicks instead of brains because a lot of these people don't even have brains to begin with. By all means, risk your dumb life to get a selfie. It's cool, though. I made a video talking shit about someone who probably deserves it. There's just something special about saying, hey, the world is burning. Who's got the marshmallows? Plus, it's cool to make fun of dumb people because they never get the joke anyways. If you think that's mean, okay, it's mean. But it doesn't change the fact that we're only getting worse. I'm not here to complain. I'm not even offended by the way that people act. I learned a long time ago, most people suck. But it doesn't change the fact that if the world's going to end, I just want to make sure I have some popcorn to watch it all go down. Before I bounce, let me ask you this. Does this guy learn from the situation and become a better person, or does he just stay the same asshole as he always was? Let me know in the comments. By the way, good on the dude in the orange shirt. You, my friend, are a real one. All right, they call me Mexican Ed, and I'm a little messed up in the head. Thanks for watching.